Alright, got our OC Fair badge. It's time to go eat some food at the OC Fair. Here for about three hours, kind of getting a VIP tour around the uh, the fair. Trying to eat and see as much as we can before we uh, we head on with our day. We're going to be shooting some reckless eating videos as well as trippy food. I'm going to link everyone down below. Make sure to check them out and subscribe. So, here at the fair, you guys just saw a little montage of things happening. We've got a uh, an escort that's walking around because we've got camera equipment and stuff like that uh, that's following us everywhere, which is, it's strange, it's really cool, it's nice. Like She's really nice. She's cool. Uh, they just gotta make sure we don't kill anyone with tripods and stuff like that, so. We're just kinda sitting here enjoying a uh, cold refreshment while they grab some more foods. Speaking of the devil, what'd you find? Deep fried hummus. Deep fried hummus. Oh, this is what we've been waiting for. All right. You guys will see this on the Reckless Eating Channel. Cheers. Oh, I'm in. Let's go. Oh, I'm so ready. Are I you so happy too. right now? <laughs> Oh. He's so oh. happy, he's breaking things. Oh, here, hold that, hold that I just, I'm gonna, I am, but I'm gonna I'm get so my excited. I just... Those are like the size of your head. I'm so ready. This is a beautiful day. <laughs> no dip, we're just going dry. I mean, Hello, if, sweetie. If you want, do you want, so do you want some like, ketchup and stuff we can dip in it, or you just want to go for it? Nah, let's just go for it, it'll make it harder. That was what you wanted, this sweet. This is exactly what I wanted. I was like, <laughs> what is she eating? I want those. Oh, was it really exactly what you wanted? Yes, I He was just talking about it. Oh, <laughs> sweetie. You know what? Happy that I got to try the corn dog. Yeah. That was good. That was good. Good find. I'm glad you came through with it. I mean, oh, come on, there's so, this there's is so a ridiculous stick. That's this a big is, stick. <laughs> All right, so just filmed a whole bunch of things here at the OC Fair. We're getting ready to wrap up. We're gonna film a couple more things. Nancy and I are gonna get out of here. Make sure to check out Val's channel. Subscribe to him if you don't already. Uh, you're gonna see a bunch of shit on the Reckless Eating channel. That was a lot of fun. We've got a main show filming coming up next. Yeah. And a little bit of other things that we're working on. I'm gonna catch up with you guys in just a minute. Today we're gonna be heading down to Oceanside, San Diego County. Nancy's down there, she's working this weekend. Instead of driving to and from and to and from, we decided to get a room for just one single night, which means I got about 48 hours in San Diego. Uh, 20, let's say 30, 30 something. We'll see at the end of this video. What we have right here is a gift from a friend. If you guys follow me on Twitter, if you don't follow me on Twitter, you guys should, should click the link down below and start following me. I posted on Twitter and I had said, oh, I just saw PBR, Past Blue Ribbon, was doing a, they were doing a special beer. It was a coffee beer. The coffee beer was only available in the Northeast United States of America in six states. There was only six states out of all 50. There was only six. Oh. So I posted, I said, if any of my Twitter friends in one of those six states tracks one down and wants to send it to me so we can review it on Reckless Eating and for me to enjoy, oh, I'd greatly much appreciate it. And guess what? Lori, Lori hooked it up, sent me a message on Twitter and was like, I found it. And here it is. Look at that. PBR hard coffee, a 5% hard coffee. I'm really excited to try this. There's four in here. I'm gonna make sure Matt gets one. So big shout out to Lori for coming through on the PBR hard coffee. I'm, I'm really excited to try that. Different, but fun. And the fact that it was only available in a small region and where I'm able to have it in my hands out here is something really cool.
Oceanside, we meet again. Just made it down here, too early to check into the hotel room, so I'm gonna go head down to the pier. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. I'm excited to be back down here. I'm excited to have like, you know, the next 24 or 30, what did we say earlier? Uh, I'm gonna try and make the best of it. Nancy gets off later this afternoon. We're gonna go grab food and drinks and stuff. Uh, I'm gonna need food, like now, because that's still like seven hours away. And uh, see if we can track her down. eating Patreon main show done. Main show entry 110. Got to see Nancy on her lunch earlier. Uh, we grabbed some fish tacos because you know when you're by the beach you gotta eat something fishy. The city of Oceanside really isn't known for much other than housing Camp Pendleton which is a marine base being by the water having lots of beach space. Restaurant wise they do have some pretty damn good restaurants around here. I don't know what we're gonna go eat. sleep last night. Look, there's Nancy. Nancy's made it into this vlog. You want to break down dinner last night? We went to dinner and you end up getting a wristband. It's an electronically charged wristband. I think it was too loud, so I'm uh, just covering my bases. Yeah. You put it up to the machine and it activates whatever beer draft you wanted to pour. That was... Can you pour your own? You pour yeah. your own. It looks like you got about a 30 ounce limit, I believe it was, but you're pouring your own beer. I have to go check in and then be like, yes, I still have my own wristband. Yes, I still want to buy more beer. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, so you're not waiting for anyone. They had a fairly decent selection. A lot of local brews, but a lot, like half of it was uh, that kombucha. kombucha shit. Yeah. And like sparkling seltzers and stuff like that. So they've been around for four or five years. I think it was it was a really, really fun idea. Very cool idea. I would probably go back if I were taking people to go experience it for themselves. Yeah. But I don't know if I'd be like, oh, we're back in Oceanside, let's, let's go, go do again. it again. Yeah. Uh, food was moderate, came out really quick. I'll probably pre-prep. So it wasn't like fresh grub food. Uh, yeah, pretty... literally like we ordered and we got our food within like four minutes. So it had to have been sitting back there. Now she's gonna head off to work. I gotta go head home. We're getting coffee right now. Is this brown cup coffee?
Sunshine, little cool air, watch a little surfing. That was the Supergirl Pro uh, presented by Nissan. It is the female surfing competition just up north about two hours from here in Huntington Beach. They are having the US Open of surfing. Uh, so yeah, if any of you guys pay attention to surfing, maybe you don't, maybe you do. I got to just enjoy and hang out, cruise their boardwalk. But now, now here's the deal. I've got to drive home. It's about a two hour drive home from this point. Kind of not looking forward to it. Wish I was just able to like snap my fingers and be there. But uh, yeah, I mean, I might be able to. Let's try. And I made it. Woo, home. I mean, I guess that worked. It worked pretty well. Like a snap of the fingers. I didn't have to drive two and a half hours. 